so divine. I'm so divine. In perfection, perfection. Two thousand square foot property, you know, and you're looking at comps. Is it the same if you're looking at a two bedroom, eleven hundred square feet property? Is is that the type of comps you want to look at, or do you, or what do you want to look at as far as comparing? Well, well, the the best way is you're gonna you're gonna look at comps similar to what you're selling or what you're buying. So if you have four bedrooms, look for four bedrooms, uh, four bedroom uh, uh, houses. You, if you sell, if, if you're looking for a two bedroom apartment, a uh, two bedroom um, house, and a four, and you're and the one you're buying is four, they're not going to be comparable. Yeah. They're going to be slim, similar, but not comparable. Yeah. So you're looking for you're looking for exactly what you're buying. So you could you could now negotiate the time that the prices. You can negotiate. Uh, um, when. What, 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 yeah, absolutely, one hundred percent. When when realtors uh put properties on market, right? They they put the property on market and they sell it a, a specific dollar amount per square foot. Correct. They that that you know for 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 the average Joe Schmo, the green investor, the most you know, the common Joe Schmo. Uh, how much is it for a four bedroom, one bathroom house? It's typically X amount of dollars. Okay, no problem. How much is it for a three bedroom? Typically that. But when you get into the nitty gritty and you talk to an actual experienced realtor in that market, in that area, they're going to break it down square per footage, foot. price per square footage. Mm -hmm. Correct. Price per, right? Bathrooms, bedrooms, comparables. So every square foot counts and it's this amount of money and that's what it's going for. Right. Because you, you don't want to look at something, you don't want to look at something, the comparables, right? You're looking at the comps. And you go, oh wow, 300, 350, 400. Oh my, I can I can sell this for that. And they have four bedrooms and the square footage is a lot more than your two bedroom, right? And you're thinking you can get it all for that. hundred percent. Right? When you're not understanding, you know, the square footage plays a big role. Yeah, if Lance, if Lance has a 2,000 square foot, four bedroom, two bathroom house, and I have a 1,400, 1,100 square foot, two bedroom, one bathroom house, we're not in the same ballpark. Right. You're not getting right. you're not getting for yours what I'm getting for mine. My square footage is going to be, mind you, that same example. We're in the same neighborhood. You know, we're in the same neighborhood. Right. My Thank square you. footage is going to be comparable, if not exact, to his square footage, but he has more square footage. Right. Right. So if, you know what, what DT is telling you if you want to uh, what challenge what he says or or, or kind of review what he says in Zillow. You go to Zillow and they usually say it square right. foot is ninety-seven dollars. Right. Each square foot. So sure. you could you kind of can see that what he's saying in, in broad daylight when you just go on Zillow. Just and those are out. those are real numbers. Like you know, we're not making right. that up. You know, and that that's that's across the world, across the border. You know, it doesn't matter where you're at.